Clay has been working outside in the garage all day today. I've been folding laundry, trying to get caught up again. He just sent me a text and said, come outside, I have a surprise for you. So I'm gonna go see what he's been up to out here all day today. Hopefully something very exciting. Guys, good morning and welcome back. We have got something planned later today that's gonna to be extremely fun. But uh, first things first, we've got a handful of chores we've got to take care of. Uh, I'm outside trying to get the garages cleaned up or trying to clean up on the inside. I mean, after Christmas, it's always a struggle to try to find a new place for everything. Uh, so sometimes that requires us to like get rid of some old stuff, but it always feels like we're constantly having to organize, clean, uh, declutter. And uh, so we're working on that today. And as soon as that's done, um, we're going to go out and do uh, some fun as a family later tonight. We got the garage all cleaned up. There's enough room for Terry to be able to park her van in here. She has been bugging me for a while to make that happen. And uh, let's just say I just scored some major points with her. She doesn't like parking outside in the winter, which I don't blame her. And uh, as long as Austin can keep it clean, she'll be able to park in here. I'm going to get the van pulled in here and uh, make sure it fits and then I'm gonna go inside and get cleaned up because me and the boys are gonna go uh, do go-kart racing tonight with a buddy of mine. He's bringing his boys and uh, we're gonna go have some fun. Clay has been working outside in the garage all day today. I've been folding laundry trying to get caught up again. He just sent me a text and said come outside I have a surprise for you. So I'm gonna go see what he's been up to out here all day today. Hopefully something very exciting. All right I don't see anything but it is definitely a lot cleaner. Oh, the van finally fits in the garage. Oh my gosh. I've waited so long for this. Yay! <laughs> How's that? Am I in? Hallelujah. You can come forward a little bit more. That's good. I need to get a tennis ball. <laughs> you guys, this is like what I've been asking for for months. I just want to park the van in the garage. Not a new car, but at least you can park inside. How's that? Well, it'll suffice for today. <laughs> Good. For today. <laughs> Forever. Forever. Just kidding. But Come thank on. you for cleaning up the garage. You're welcome. Now I don't have to park in the snow just anymore. Don't you and Austin come out here and tear any more dirt bikes apart this winter, okay? Me and Austin? Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> Not me. Owen and I are headed down to the go-kart racing place. Austin and his buddy Lance are going to meet us down there. Um, Owen here is quite competitive, which uh, makes it really fun. He's not going to just let me win, which I hate losing. He hates losing. It makes for some good times when we both really want to win. I just, I don't show any mercy, even with my own kids. <laughs> I'm in it to win it. Who's winning, bud? I'm not going to show you any mercy. You're not? No. You're going to strike fast, strike hard, no mercy? Exactly. <laughs> uh, let's just try and maybe we can team up and beat Austin and Lance. Like Maybe that's our goal. Is, Sabotage them. Yeah, exactly. We'll just kind of bump them a little bit so they're off the road a little bit. And we'll win. All right, okay, all right. <laughs> Owen agrees. Owen agrees. That's a great plan. We're going to stick with that. Should be a fun night. So let's get down there. While Clay and the boys are at the go kart track, the girls and I are just here at home hanging out. It's freezing cold outside today. It snowed and the wind blew all day today. I have not left the house today because I do not go out in the freezing cold weather. <laughs> So we're just here deciding on what we're gonna do for dinner. And while we're deciding, the girls are making themselves an Orbeez spa. I'm not sure why they love these Orbeez so much, but they do. They've actually been hanging out in the garage this bucket of Orbeez has for the last week because I'm gonna show you here in a second. It's enormous, but we had to make space for Christmas. So we had to throw it in the garage. I'm surprised it's not frozen, honestly, girls. <laughs> they just brought it back in, filled it up with warm water, and- It's still cold. It's still cold. They have their feet in it. It looks good. Oh. We need more hot water, and I'm eating a pickle. Carmen's, of course, eating a pickle. Now we need a little bit more hot water. Orbeez, I despise Orbeez, people. Like We're did. probably gonna get Orbi eye. Orbi eye? We made up our own sickness called Orbi eye. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's weird. What, what happens if you get Orbi eye? You stare at like um, if you stare at Orby so long, then the when day, you close your eyes, all you will see is Orby, and I just got Orby eye. <laughs> so if Orby you stare at the Orbeez for too long, and then when you close your eyes, all you see is a bunch of colorful balls. Yeah, so then you get Orby eye. 
or BI. That's hilarious. I mean, they feel cool, they look cool, but they make such a mess. Poppy ate a little bit of one. Oh no. Okay, so did we decide what we're gonna do for dinner? Chipotle! Oh man. So when we got there, uh, we got there like right when they opened. They said that they were booked out for like four and a half hours. So we got our names on the list. Went and grabbed dinner for a minute. Picked up a couple hitchhikers. We usually don't pick up hitchhikers. But I'm gonna go with my instinct on this one. Saddle up, partner. Austin and his buddy Lance. And uh, we're now trying to just kill some time. We're gonna run to Cal Ranch, have a look around. Austin wants to get himself a Carhartt vest in his quest to become a full cowboy. He feels like he's gotta have a Carhartt vest. Owen, do you have your uh, eye on anything at Cal Ranch? Some boots. Some, you want some boots? Are you serious? I'm convinced of. No way. Yeah. Are you kidding me? I can find a good pair of boots. Lance has got some nice boots. Some Austin boots. too. The boot brothers in the back. Dude, I can't believe you're going to get some boots. Hat. Let's go with a hat. Much cheaper than boots. Uh, and I know you want to stay cool, so don't get cowboy boots. We're having a debate on what trucks are the best. I'm trying to convince them that it's not Dodges. Lance likes the GMC. Pull up on. Austin likes the lifted uh, Ford, which I agree. It's kind of blurry. I like the G I like the Ford. It looks amazing. It's blurry, but it's sick. all right. I would take a new lifted Ford, but I'm gonna keep the one I've got. It's totally fine. I don't want to pay for six wheels because that would be quite expensive. Quite expensive. Dude, I was actually here the other day. Thought we could fit the whole family in this thing. Probably and go okay, down that uh, that bowl section. Do Christmas photos and we're all just going down the hall. <laughs> I, I get, in get in there right now, Lance. Austin, lay down right by him. It's oh, a little wet. wet. Oh, I want this. Uh, dude, don't don't worry about that. Dude, you can fit the whole ice fishing gear in here. I don't know you bought two sleds for. Well, the problem is, who's gonna pull that? Go Good luck pulling that up the hill. Oh, Back here, we've got uh, my buddy Roger. Roger lived in my neighborhood for quite a while, and then he decided to leave us, which was rude. <laughs> and he bought a new house, moved out to Saratoga Springs. And uh, he was just telling us, tell us, you know, you were explaining to your boy what uh, Cal Ranch is like. Cal Ranch is like the Nordstrom for cowboys. That's exactly That's right. right. I thought that was hilarious. <laughs> and so, uh, I'm actually impressed that your son's never been in here, which is great. I'm not into this whole cowboy thing. Uh, it's I weird. I haven't figured it out yet either. But. It is strange. <laughs> All right, let's go see if we can find Austin a vest. So Austin and Lance were here earlier. They were talking to some girls, and they showed back up. They walked in, they recognized them, and they're helping them now find something. They're looking at some boots. All of these boots are like... And like Carhartt vests. Where are the Carhartt vests? Um, the Carhartt vests would be in our Carhartt section over here. Okay, we're going to go back there in just a minute. You're not seriously thinking about getting some boots, are you? <laughs> you better save up your pennies on those ones. Like, How much are those? $210. Not like cowboy boots, right? They're not like cowboy boots. What the boots they got here, man? They're just like normal boots. I feel like you need the denim ones. We are finally headed back to the grid. It was unfortunate we had to wait for four hours, but uh, it is a crazy busy place. And uh, we're gonna head in there and get all uh, suited up, get our helmets on, and then it's go time. I just, uh, we went bowling for a minute. And I beat Owen, and now he's like ready to beat me. So he's got the eye of the tiger right now. These boys in the back, we're not worried about them. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna take first. You are? Yeah, you see my tail lights. All right. One of the main things that Claire wanted for Christmas this year was a clay earring kit where she can like make her own earrings out of clay. We bake them, and then you can glue on the little backs to become earrings. So her and Carmen are going to make some little figurines out of their clay they got, and then we'll bake it. We don't have the earring backs because we thought it came with them, but it did not, so we gotta order those off Amazon. But they can still make super cool designs out of this clay that she got for Christmas. Clay? Came with how many colors, Claire? 50? 48. 48. Super cool. Why you guys haven't seen um, me open this was because it was um, when we were opening Carmen's camera, we were all, me, and my mom, and Carmen were sitting by the Christmas tree, and my mom was like, what is that one present? And it was for me and Claire, and we opened it and it was this. Yeah. It was the one Christmas present we forgot under the tree. How does yeah. that even happen? We did it last year, too. We, we did? We do it every year. <laughs> we forget a present every it's year. It's like a tradition that we don't even know. <laughs> okay, so. Okay, so what are you guys thinking you're gonna make? I Mine's a surprise, so I can't say. Okay. Um, I got these, so like you could roll it out and then you could just make a circle, you know? 
Oh yeah? Yeah. Good idea. So I got all these. Oh, Ooh, I could use this. Okay. I just don't know what I'm gonna make. Okay. We have all these fun colors. There's a lot in there to choose from. Wow. And then, what are these? Just like. So there's, um, here, I'll get some out. There are actually a couple of earring backs, but not like a ton. Yeah. Here, let me pour them out. They're like dangly earring backs, though. Oh, to make long earrings? Yeah. Dude. There's a pin, too. Like there's that. these weird beads, but there's also a mist where you could like put it on the back and then it'd be like a little chain. Here's a ring. Yeah, there's also a you hair. You can make a ring. You could also yeah, make like cool. that thing of clay and then put it on this hair clip. So this, uh, you just put it, you see that little circle thing right there? Mm, kind of, it's hard to focus on it. Oh, well you just put it on that or you can like circle around and then you um, have one. But yeah, and then there's a pin that you can do. There's a little keychain. Cool. Looks like you guys got lots of options. Yeah. Okay, let's get started making something awesome. All right, girls, how's it coming? Good. Carmen what have made, you created? Carmen made this mando for Owen. Awesome. And then I made this for Carmen. Because this is a way, you can't really read it, it's kind of hard. Skateboard. Cool. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna make next. When she bakes it, I'm putting it on my backpack. <laughs> That'll be awesome. All right, so now we have to preheat the oven, right? Yeah. But I'm not done. No, yeah, we're gonna keep making things, but we should just preheat the oven. Carmen, what are you making? Pretty cool. Um, a surprise for Claire. Oh, you're not revealing it yet? Yeah. Well, she probably already knows, but. Oh my gosh, just cooperate. That's all I want you to do. Oh. Is it too much to ask? <laughs> <laughs> this is just gonna be a really cute charm. Freaking out. All right, the oven is on. It's heating up for you. Yes. As soon as you're done with all your creations, we can stick them on a pan and put them in there. Mine's I just cut this off of the clay and it turned out like a perfect watermelon slice. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going insane! Just <laughs> literally work! Maybe you need to take a deep breath and try again. No, chug this across the room. <laughs> no. Okay, here are the girls' creations. This is Carmen's. What is this, Carmen? Um, the two pink cherries. Or Pepto-Bismol. It's really Pepto-Bismol. Yeah. <laughs> she, she made it into Pepto-Bismol. This is Mandalorian. Watermelons. What is this? The snowman. A snowman. A C. Real clear. What's this from? A hair clip. A hair clip. And this is a skateboard. An awesome skateboard. It says this is the way. You cannot see it because it's not our own language. So it's well, it's not our language. <laughs> no, I said it's our me and Claire's language. Oh, I get it. Okay. It's All right. called messy handwriting. Awesome. Let's stick these in the oven. Clean up, and we have 15 minutes to wait until they're all done. 15? 15 Whoa. minutes. Meanwhile. <laughs> what is that? It's from MTV. All right, looks like they're done. Oh, it smells really hot. Yeah, you're gonna have those cool down. Did they burn? For a little while. All right, those little clay things they built have to cool down and sit until tomorrow morning. So it is time for you two crazies to go get your jammas on and brush your teeth. I do have my jammas on for a fact. Okay, well, Claire well, doesn't. Fact for the day, I actually do have my jammas on. But you need to brush your teeth. Brush, 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 all done. Okay, so craft time is over. Yeah. Let's go brush your teeth. And then, since how dad's not home yet, we can snuggle and watch a movie. Deal done. For a little bit. That's right. sold. You, you say it wrong. It's done deal, not deal done. It's done deal. I didn't say deal done. We're talking to Claire McNeil. Claire, 
deal is done taken. Deal. It's a done deal. Deal or no <laughs> deal? Deal. All right, ready, set, deal. go. Yeah. Who's winning? Lance smoking Austin. Mm. It's 4 1. I'll use both hands. Ooh. Austin's about to rub a bank. Get smacked. We have been waiting forever. We're supposed to go at 9 30. It's now 10 o'clock. We're supposed to be closing here soon. So hopefully they can get us in. There's just a lot of people around at the moment. got done and I am not feeling well. After about five, six laps, I was sick. But tonight's winner is Lance Locken coming in uh, third out of 11. And uh, then we got Ethan at fourth, Roger at eighth, Austin at ninth, Owen at 10th. And coming in last, myself, I came in dead last. I was driving the go-kart like I drive the van, just both hands on the wheel, 10 and 2, nice and steady, because I am not feeling well. I should have taken some Dramamine, something, but uh, these things get me every time I go on them. I should learn by now, but I haven't. All right, good work, boys. Let's get out of here. Let me guess, Lance. Do you just want to go fast? I just want to go fast. Speed <laughs> for speed. Did you have fun? Yeah. Did you Sick, hit me? Though. You hit me. I wasn't sure if that was you or not, and I was like, crap. I, I also got hit by Ethan, and I was like, yeah, I was I pretty I, offended, I'm not going to lie to you. I, I was like... I didn't pass anyone. What's that? I didn't pass anyone. No, was it you that like backed up after you hit me? Or was that somebody else? No, I didn't hit anyone. Oh. I didn't hit anyone. Lance I, came in and ran me. I, I, was like, I was like, oh, and is that you? And I'm like, it must have been one of the other guys, but it looked like you. I couldn't tell what the hell went on, so... No, that was cool, guys. Thank you. Get out of here. I have made it back home and I'm finally starting to get a little color back in my face after about, you know, three laps. Uh, I'm pretty sure I was pretty pale because I was <laughs> getting sick. I almost like drove past a guy and was like, just let me out of here. Yeah, go-karts are not really your thing, huh? They re they're really not, Like, but I, I, I still keep going. Like I haven't learned yet that they're not my thing. But, they're fun so. until you're sick. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I got about three laps. I should just tell them when I go in, like I'm gonna be sick, so wait for me to like, <laughs> wave my hand and let me out of here but uh, Lance actually beat us all oh yeah which was job. interesting so we actually went bowling which we didn't show and I might I don't want to brag but I may have won at bowling of and Lance you took last you always win at bowling at bowling but then he beat us <laughs> at go-karts like I use awesome. ama he's amazingly fast behind the <laughs> go-kart so it's a super fun night it's fun to hang out with Roger and his boy Ethan uh, good friend of mine We've been friends for a while 
and uh, just a fun night. So, did you guys have fun? We did. We just kind of hung out here and made clay creations and clay creations. Did you make a clay creation of me, clay? <laughs> Or no? I didn't. I let the well, girls work on it. Carmen's well, actually I... really good at drawing me, and like, she might be good at creating me with clay <laughs> creations. She will be. Just yes, we'll have her straight down. We'll have her make one tomorrow <laughs> of you. Can't wait to see it. It's gonna be amazing. Yes. So guys, like this video. Uh, we love you guys. We'll see you guys back here tomorrow.